Number 1. Palais de Papes To visit the Palais de Papes is to witness the power of the papacy during the Middle Ages. Designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, this imposing palace was the most important monument in Christendom during the 14th century, when Pope Clement V moved the papal court from Rome to Avignon. Number 2. Musée du Petit Palais Built between the 13th and 15th centuries, the Petit Palais was the residence for Avignon's Episcopal bishops before Pope Clement V created the Palais de Papes. This UNESCO-listed building was designed as a Gothic fort and is distinguished by the crenellated outer wall, a defensive feature typical of medieval and Renaissance fortresses. Number 3. Pont saint Benezet. This graceful 13th-century landmark is one of Avignon's most iconic sites. The saint Benezet Bridge intrigues visitors because of its romantic half-ruined state and legendary association. Many are familiar with the famous song about the bridge, Sir Lou Pont de Vignon, which was originally composed in the 16th century. Number 4. Cathedral Notre Dame de Dames Although this building pales in comparison to the nearby Palais de Papes, the Cathedral of Notre Dame de Dames is still worth a visit. This beautiful 12th-century cathedral has a serene Romanesque interior. Upon entering through the main doorway, visitors will notice the remains of frescoes by Simone Martin. Number 5. Eglise Saint Didier To the east of the Rue de la République stands the single-aisled Church of Saint Didier. Built between 1356 and 1359, the Saint Didier Church exemplifies Provençal Romanesque architecture with its thick stone walls and large nave that gives the impression of an exceptional spaciousness. Number 6. Place de l'Horloge The idyllic Place de l'Horloge is a pleasant place to relax at a street café under the shady plane trees. Near the Palais de Papes, this beautiful square is the very center of Avignon life. Number 7. Rocher des Dames A short walk away from the Palais de Papes, the Rocher des Dames is a rocky promontory that offers an exceptional panoramic view of Avignon. This location has a gorgeous park on its summit, which is a wonderful place for a leisurely stroll. Number 8. Eglise Saint-Pierre This site was dedicated to Saint-Pierre of Luxembourg in the 7th century and the relics of the saint are kept here. Built in 1356, the Church of Saint-Pierre has a beautiful Gothic façade and carved Renaissance wooden doors dating from 1550. Number 9. Avignon Festivals Avignon hosts dozens of cultural events and festivals throughout the year. One of the biggest summertime events in Provence, the Festival de Vignon presents a diverse cultural program that includes theatre, film, and art exhibits. Every night in July, Performances are held at various indoor or outdoor venues throughout the city. Number 10. Musée Calvet The Musée Calvet has a wonderful collection of antique sculptures, medieval paintings by Provençal masters, Italian paintings from the 16th to 19th centuries, and French paintings from the 16th to the 20th centuries, as well as a selection of Spanish and Dutch works. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.